Hey guys, for this let you know that you can now go ahead and download the latest Opera and it's the version 11.15 comes with some interesting things. Now, whoa, what happened there? What did they do? But if you go to Opera.com right now, then you will see that it's only the version 11.01 .01, and it's not this new one and that is because this new build, it makes you see 11.50 preview build, it's not like official stable but there's some very interesting things that they've added in this release so I will provide a down link description if you want to try it out but the two new big things that they've added is first of all they have now enabled hardware exploration so it will be able to compete with Instagram 9, the Firefox, the latest Firefox 4 and the Google Chrome 10 and also they have now made support for WebGL so you can do all of these cool things that Google have like Google have a lot of cool things in WebGL and WebGL I think that's also pictures that is smaller than JPEG but you still have that awesome quality but I think the WebGL things on online it's going to increase you may not see that a big change right now but it's cool that they've added that support and okay so first of all this hardware exploration thingy finally it will be able to compete with these kinds of fish tank tests and stuff like that because it got awesome hardware exploration and it's using OpenGL to use uh, to have this hardware exploration thingy and the good thing with OpenGL is that then you, the Opera browser will be able to take or use this OpenGL on every platform so like almost every platform like OS X smartphones and like web enabled TVs they will be able to use this hard resolution in the latest Opera because it uses OpenGL now if it would use like DirectX or Direct2D like the Intel Core 9 is doing then you can't use it on like every single platform because in Intel 9, the latest Microsoft release, uh, you can only use this hard drive release on Windows 7 and Vista, not even Windows XP, I think. So that kind of sucks, you know. And then we have the awesome support, as I said, the WebGL. You will be able to go now in the Google body and like experiment with that. And Google also have a lot of like experiments with WebGL. You can see it's Google to find some awesome things to you know try out and some things that didn't really seem to work and some things in WebGL that works in Firefox 4 and the latest Google Chrome like the Flight of Navigator WebGL demo doesn't seem to work in Opera 11.50 but hey it's just a preview build hopefully it will work awesome in the stable release so they will probably update the website in a couple of days so kind of cool so now when you have WebGL if Fire or if Opera is your main browser then you'll be able to go and do things like this yeah, I know. I know, I know. But there, there's some cool Google body. This Google body labs, it's it's kind of epic, you know. You can do some epic things. Yeah. I know, I, I'm not trying this in Opera. Maybe I should. Because I'm making a video about Opera. But yeah, guys, see you.